Do I like some of these other sneaker content creators? Not especially. Do I admire some of these other sneaker content creators? Hell no. Do I believe in Mr. Wonderful? Now that's an entirely different story. See, what you see behind me is 20 plus years in the sneaker game. And yet, to this day, I continue to add on to the FC Sneaker Factory. But yet, YouTube doesn't give me the push that I so gratefully deserve on building my subscribers or building my views. And yet, I see all these other sneaker content creators channel continue to go up in views. The subscribers are up for the time being. For the time being. See, it's not who's ahead of the war, but it's who emerges at the tail end of the war, the victor. <laughs> and I must say, in my lifetime, I've stepped out and in any competition I've been in, emerged the victor. And it's no different with YouTube. See, at this current time, these other sneaker content creators channels are up in the numbers. But I'm up in my fucking delivery. And at the end of the day, you people out there, the fellas and those beautiful ladies, ho oh, ho, that I call my cheerleaders, will see exactly who the fuck is Mr. Wonderful and who are all these fucking wannabes. Let me remind you, you are tuning in to the real, the authentic, the one and only Mr. Wonderful's in the fucking factory. And yes, like I always give it to you, like the great Skull Hall used to say, hey, yo, Floyd Chavez here. As you can see, I'm in the FC sneaker factory where Mr. Wonderful belongs. Of course, to bring you another Floyd's pickups. But before we even get into the, the survey, because we know we're going to go that direction. Since I'm already standing up, let's go ahead and do that great fit check that Mr. Wonderful always brings you. Of course, I'm about to go on a date. So I said, you know what? I'm looking nice. I'm looking fresh. And I feel fucking amazing. So let's go ahead and drop a Floyd's pickup since I'm always looking so damn ravishing. But here we go. I am rocking that beautiful utility blue Lululemon long sleeve tee. And of course, you see that the beautiful tag aqua racer on the wrist. And of course, some light blue rag and bone denim. So I hope you're doing amazing because you know Mr. Wonderful is doing amazing. And of course, let's go ahead and get on to that survey that I always bring you. So since we're on you, wait, hold on. There you go. There we go. Since we're on YouTube, let's go ahead and take that survey. So who's out there? The fellas and those beautiful ladies. Oh, that I call my cheerleaders. Who's out there thinking that they're going to get a pickup video where the content creator is lying to you. He puts that 10 K pickup and you see the same fucking shoe over and over again. Okay. So that means the people that are in attendance, the people that came to see Mr. Wonderful, have come to see an amazing unboxing. And Mr. Wonderful cut one of those fucking amazing promos. So as you are all aware... <laughs> We keep going and going with these Floyd's pickups. And of course, right here, Mr. Wonderful does not skip a damn beat with these items that you see in the thumbnail. And of course, you see the beautiful, the amazing woman, Jima Chan, in there. Oh, looking so damn amazing, looking so damn beautiful. Of course, that she always does it. But of course, you see Mr. Wonderful <laughs> in the thumbnail as well. Covering the thumbnail along with Jima Chan. And of course, you see those packages very little, right? Because that's not the focal point. The focal point is myself and Jima Chan.
but you see those packages and those packages never lie to you. I never add more packages to make it look like it's just some huge Floyd's pickups. I always, whatever I put in the picture is whatever I deliver. And this, honestly, this one right here, this one right here is freaking amazing. I cannot wait to open these because these are actually all amazing items. I got an amazing pair of shoes and I got a lot of clothing items and a couple accessories that I just cannot wait to see. And it's been quite some time since I haven't opened any of, the, any of these packages. And honestly, when it comes to the clothing, I'm, I wasn't in no hurry because I mean, I'm not, I bought them from the, like the retail uh, main, really main uh, websites online. So I know they're all real. So there's nothing to even worry about when it comes to that. So let's go ahead and get on to Floyd's pickups. But in case you're wondering, let me remind you really quick. YouTube is my fucking pedestal. And when it comes to the sneaker game, this is definitely Mr. Wonderful's playground. So let's go ahead and go on to it. I cannot wait to deliver these package to you. And of course, I'm looking amazing because like I mentioned before, I'm about to beat one of the beautiful cheerleaders. Of course, she holds a dear place in this beautiful heart. Okay, so let's go ahead and go to this first one. So this one, this first one right here. So this is actually, I don't know. Let me know, drop a comment down below. Have you ever heard of good man clothing? I first came across this on Nordstrom actually. So I came across one particular item and I just really wanted it and it sold out like instantly. And I checked the web, I, and then I went after it on the website and I was able to find the website because the website, it's not, it's not actually under Goodman. It's actually under some other, um, I wanted to see if there's a receipt in here, but it's not. But it's actually under some, I forgot the website's name, but if you do search Goodman, you will, or I'm sorry, Goodman, you will see the actual brand. And here, here's the actual website that you can look up the clothing. Great clothing. I really like, there's a lot of nice bomber jackets, just a lot of like material uh, pieces that Mr. Wonderful would wear. Cause I honestly, I do try to keep it simple because I feel like when you go back to the basics, that's where it's at and that's what the women like. And that's what Mr. Wonderful feels comfortable in. Of course, I have those extreme pieces, right? Of course, the FC Sneaker Factory, especially when it comes to the, to the closet, it has a lot of those pieces, but it's also the fundamentals, right? The, the basics is what it's really built upon. And I suggest if you're trying to build up your wardrobe, start with the basics, solid shirts, solid long sleeve shirts, uh, solid short sleeve shirts, build that up with enough colors and then go into like Henley's stuff like that. And then after that, once you have a solid rotation, that's when you want to start going out and buying those like other pieces, you know, the more high end pieces, because then at least you can, you don't, you don't want to be wearing those high end pieces all the time because people will definitely point that out. But you want to, you always want to fall back on those, those basic pieces. And this one right here, just a basic piece, but it looks so damn amazing. So the website is the house of LR and C. I don't know what that means. But this piece right here is just freaking amazing. And I want you to remember this piece because I actually have an accessory to go along with this piece. But great piece. So this is actually going to be for the fall time when it starts cooling down. I could probably maybe bust this out maybe during the, the summer nights. Those little colder evenings, summer nights. But this is basically just a, a mid button up. Probably like around right here where it ends. It does have a hoodie. And it's actually, it's not, I want to say it's not white though. Well, actually it is, it's Blanc de Blanc. So in case you know, don't know, that is white. So this is actually white, but to me, it kind of looks like an off-white. So it's not so bright when it comes to the white, which is what I really like. But when it comes to this piece, I would really have to be careful where I'm going to wear it too, because you definitely don't want to wear it somewhere where it's going to get dirty. Okay. So Perfect piece right here. Great piece. I cannot wait to actually put that on. Obviously, that's not going to be until further on down, down down the fall line or fall season. 
is what I should have said. But that is a medium, and obviously I will be doing a short, but who knows when that short's going to be dropping because I'm, like, really stacked up on shorts when it comes to Mr. Wonderful's content. But here we go. Here's another item, or here's multiple items. So this one is I have actually been sitting on for quite some time, and I'm so happy to finally open it because it is – there's quite a bit of items in here, and I just can't wait to actually finally see them. So as you can see – not have been this has never been open let me go ahead and take this exacto nice right right here and let's go ahead and open this box up so as you can see nicely packaged this is one thing so this comes from end clothing okay end clothing and i i do buy uh quite a bit of items from this website but they always, I love the packaging. They never fail with the packaging. They always package it really well. And it looks like this one, another perfect packaging. So as you can see right there, and clothing, great. I love it. They always put it in these like, this one particularly in like a shoe box, but this is no shoe. This is actually a good amount of items in this one. So hopefully they're all nicely packaged and they're some of the, and the items aren't smashed because some of these items in here can get smashed based on what they are. But let's take a look at this. All right, so here we go. So I got my end clothing receipt right there. Perfect. Nicely packaged in that nice tissue paper. So if you never ordered anything from end clothing, this is what they normally do. They always put tissue paper around your item. And then you can go ahead and just rip it up and take a look at it let's take a look at this see these items when it comes to this right here i don't mind ripping it up because it's not a pair of shoes okay so as you can see nicely packaged let's go ahead and take these items out one by one we'll start with this one first so this is all packaged up good so i don't have to worry about putting plastic around my hats but this is that amazing and this is what that that piece right there that i just unboxed this is what it's going to go with so this is a nice rude banquet day rude hat right here so i love all these hits on this definitely a great piece as you can see a lot of rude hits you do got that rude hit right there and that rude hit right there so Gorgeous piece, a nice hat. And I, I forgot, I believe I got this one on sale, I want to say. That's why I picked it up. But this is a nice, solid black hat. And this is going to go perfect with that nice, good man right there piece. Let me go ahead and put this back in the box or in the package. So this is going to go, let me move this over here. So right here, look at, let's take a look at that. That's going to go perfect with that. And of course, Probably maybe some black denim or maybe even gray denim and of course some amazing shoes Now let's take a look at this new this other item. So right here do got another perfect rude hat And I do have a perfect shirt to go with this and you will see that later on in this episode But let's take a look at this Right here. So here we go. Another one rude motorsports Nice navy blue there's no other hits just besides that front hit right there another so what I want you to remember is the blue obviously and then look at this color right here it's kind of like a maroon color so remember these colors right here because we're going to return to this one a little bit later when I pull out one of the other pieces so another great hat perfect hats for the summertime because that's what it, that's typically when I wear a lot of hats especially when I mean I try not to be lazy very often but there are those lazy times where I just don't feel like doing my hair. So that's when I do bust out a hat. So I like to have a good amount of hats. Now let's go ahead and take a look at this. So remember back, right? I would probably want to say this was last year. But Carhartt and New Balance, they did a collaboration together. They actually released a shoe together. And I was very fortunate enough to pick that one up on eBay for a decent price. But I also, if you remember back then, I picked up a nice um, Carhartt New Balance. The the whole capsule, the whole capsule was pretty was solid, 
And I didn't pick up this piece because I just wasn't sure about it, but I did pick up a long sleeve navy piece to go perfectly with those shoes because it was it was all one entire capsule. Wow. With that said, and I also remember I did pick up those socks too. Well, I found this on End Clothing. It was actually on sale, so I picked up this shirt right here. As you can see, it is from that capsule, and you see that New Balance Practical physical culture i want to say that's what it was called and this is a short sleeve this is a size medium but you do have the gray beige and navy hits right here so perfect that is the the logo on the t so amazing piece right here okay so let's not forget about that okay and then next i picked up the carhartt new balance same the practical physical culture but these are the sweatpants and i really love these sweat this is actually like a gray perfect to go with that new balance that i have in the fc sneaker factory so perfect to go with that great piece right here great piece of sweats obviously i will be doing a um, short and a reel on instagram when it comes to these clothing items but this is also medium perfect another part of that capsule i mean i really enjoyed that capsule there's a lot of solid pieces and i feel like when it came to the caps capsule i picked up all the pieces that i wanted like the long sleeve tee the sweat now these two pieces right here just great pieces all the pairs of um, socks and this is going to go perfect together so more so this is like when i'm lounging around the house and I do have one of those beautiful ladies going to come over. That's something that I would wear, especially if we're not going to do anything. And we're just probably going to either have food, take out food or make dinner and then just enjoy the company of each other. Watch some TV, watch some movies and just basically lounge around the house. So that's just a perfect fit to do that in. And you're probably saying, man, Mr. Wonderful, you buy those these clothing items just to relax at home? Well, of course, especially when I have one of those beautiful ladies, the cheerleaders at the house. Of course, I'm going to be relaxing in amazing clothing items. All right, so moving on. So this piece right here. All right, so right now I got what? Two fits going on. The Carhartt fit with the New Balance fit. And then I got that beautiful good man mid button up with the nice rude hat. Now let's see what this item is for. Okay, so this is another, let me go ahead and use this. Another package and this comes from N Clothing. So this piece actually, I got lucky on this one because originally it sold out and then, it, and then I just kept checking because I, I really wanted this piece to go with that hat that I that I told you people to remember so another end clothing piece right here this one this box is a little bit banged up but let's take a look at this we do got the beautiful receipt right there from end clothing all right so this piece some another amazing piece so this one right here this is gonna go perfect it is a rude tea and it says so it's st. Bart's and this has a boat in the front, but you remember. So let me look, let me show you the T first. So this is in a nice, like a off-white beige color. You do got that beautiful maroon hits when it comes to rude. And then you also have those navy hits. But this hat, or this shirt is meant to go with this hat right here. Perfect, because it, it brings out all the colors when it comes to the hat and into this shirt. So great shirt right here. Glad to finally have that one. I was glad to see that came back and I was able to pick that up when it, I don't know if it restocked or they just found one in like in the factory or in the warehouse. So I was very fortunate enough to get that one. So now that we got all those pieces, now let's go ahead and open up the, the shoe, right? Because Mr. Wonderful always brings you a pair of shoes right here. So this is a StockX pickup right here. Now let's take a look at this one. And let's see what Mr. Wonderful has delivered this week on Floyd's pickups. So I'll give you a little hint. This is another colorway that I already have when it comes to this collaboration. That's just a little hint, but let's take a look at this beautiful shoe right here. 
All right, so here we go. Boom, opening it up for the first time. Like I mentioned, this is that beautiful StockX pickup. And from what I remember, I don't remember paying very high when it comes to this one. But let's take a look at it together. It's kind of hard because the solid box right there. Let's go ahead and take a look. So here we go. Oh, out of focus, out of focus. Let me get focus. Of course, right there, Mr. Wonderful is always in focus. All right, so this one, we do got the Alma Manier box. So you guys all see that, you see that? Women's Air Jordan 12 Retro SP, white, black. And I cannot see those words, but it is definitely in that men's size 10 and a half. And this is the Burgundy Crush, okay? Let's go ahead and take a look at this shoe. One of these fits is made for this shoe. Let's take a look at it. So, like I said though before, I already have the black and burgundy one. So, you know, right there, StockX. And I, oh, I didn't pay very much for that. I barely paid over retail. So, these ones actually, I'm surprised. They really bombed in terms of the price on these shoes. I thought they're going to do so much better, but I could care less because one, I'm a big fan of these shoes, but two, I'm a big fan of the model and I'm a big fan of the this specific collaboration when it comes to the comes to this um, model and shoe. So here we go. So I picked up to complete this one because I really wanted to complete this because I love I love both shoes, but I love this one even I love this one more than the black and burgundy one because as you remember I did an unboxing on that one of Floyd's pickups. And that one what I actually picked up for retail, so I was very happy on this, uh, on that. This one I just barely paid over retail for this. And this is the best one out of the two, based on what I'm looking at right now. So we do have that beautiful Air Jordan 12, the white and burgundy colorway, but this is that beautiful velvet. When it comes to the Ama Manier um, collaboration, so this is actually meant for this. This shirt and this hat, this shoe is meant for that, this fit. So I'm glad to put this fit together. It's gonna look freaking amazing. I'm, I'll probably more than likely wear some jeans with this because I, or even shorts, because I have to say when it comes to the Air Jordan 12s, you can actually wear those for with shorts and denim, right? Jeans, um, jean pants. <laughs> So I feel like that it's still gonna be amazing. It's gonna be perfect either way. So I'm very glad to finally un unbox all these items. As you can see, this was a solid Floyd's pickups, multiple clothing items, and then also that beautiful pair of shoes to cap the entire Floyd's pickups and end it with. As you can see, Mr. Wonderful is always looking so fucking amazing, always delivering the most amazing items when it comes to the FC Sneaker Factory. I should never let you down in that. I'm always delivering great items. Drop a comment down below. Let me know what your favorite item is out of all this. And I know all my, I know my comments are gonna be flooded and flooded with your beautiful comments out there from the fellas and those beautiful ladies that I call my cheerleader. But in case you didn't know, that was fucking sarcasm because you and I know that I hardly get any comments when it comes to my content. But at the end of the day, what will reign supreme when it comes to all these other sneaker content creators channels, Mr. Wonderful will stand out above them all because I deliver one of the fucking best deliveries and I also deliver some fucking great shoes and even great clothing items when it comes to this YouTube sneaker genre. So, what makes me different from all these other fucking channels, right? From when it comes to this sneaker genre. Well, if it, and it looks like a lot of people like that G-rated content, that cartoon content when it comes to the sneaker genre. But if you're actually a fucking grown-up, a fella and a beautiful lady, right? That's above age. You guys should be fucking tuning into my content. Because one, I bring that HBO, that Cinemax, that Showtime, 
that late night content. Because you know what? I speak my fucking mind. I cuss. Some people may say, oh, Mr. Wonderful, you cuss too damn much. Well, that's just the fucking real world. So you better deal with it because it's going to hit you either way. But those are reasons why you should be tuning into my content. Because I keep it real. I don't, I'm not here to be like, oh, you know, sit here and, and try to make you feel good about yourselves. That's not my job. You should already feel fucking great about yourself. Of course, I will give you tips to get there. But you should already know how to feel good about yourself. And it's not all about dressing wow. It's not all about the women. It's not all about the best shoes. But it's about having fucking self-respect for yourself. Knowing how to carry yourself with confidence. Right? Because we're not all built the same. Some people... Obviously, are f more fit than others. Some people have that beautiful smile like Mr. Wonderful. There's a lot of people that have different gifts. But it's up to you out there, the fellas and those beautiful ladies, to figure out what those gifts are. And if you let me, I will definitely put you on my fucking shoulders along with this channel and carry us all to that fucking promise line and we will explode together. You remember that. And remember this, cause you know what? When I first started this YouTube content, sneaker genre channel, I had big plans for this. I thought I was gonna explode out of the universe. But like this beautiful quote that I have heard before, man plans, and God laughs. But I will be laughing at all those other sneaker content creators. Because you know what? At the end of the day. The fellas out there and those beautiful ladies. Will see. Exactly. Who's the real. And who's all these other. Unauthentic people out there when it comes to the sneaker game. But surveys in, I must say, one more for the good guy. And in case you're wondering, Floyd, Mr. Wonderful, what's that smell? Oh, you see that? That smells us. Because we're the stuff. And of course, Mr. Wonderful, you are too damn sweet. And Floyd, why? Why should we tune in next time? Why? Why should we keep coming to your fucking channel? Why? Because I'm Floyd Chavez. Why? Because I created this fucking channel. Why? Because the sneaker game is my bitch.